to know the motor channel. Please like, share and subscribe. Thank you. Beta shocked the dual sport motorcycle world last year with the impressive all new 125 RRS, which used a diminutive four stroke motor in an enduro ready street legal package. This year, we get the all new 2018 Beta 125 RR two stroke enduro bike, which Beta says is designed to compete in the GNCC XC3 classes and NEPG 200cc enduro classes. Here are the essential fast facts you need to know about the 2018 Beta 125 RR. Although Beta has made 125cc two-stroke trial bikes, this is an all-new motor. There are some features inherited from the larger Betas, include the progressive power valve system. Much like shock linkage, it gives the power valve superior tuning options. Die casting is used extensively. The crankcase is die-cast aluminum, while the clutch and ignition covers are die-cast magnesium. Beta designed a unique crankcase that is lighter and more rigid where necessary. The clutch and ignition covers keep the weight low. By separating the water pump from the clutch, Beta was able to use magnesium without fear of corrosion. The 125RR's top end has a dual ring piston, removable cylinder head dome, and a unique exhaust flange. The dual ring piston design is therefore improved seam at low to mid RPM. By making the cylinder head dome independently removable, it's easier to fine tune the motor. Thanks to a separately machined exhaust flange, something beta does on the big 2018 RRs, also, the piston flat cylinder front tolerance is smaller, again, this is to reduce the leaking of gases and increase low end power. A Moto Tosinari VFORC4 reed valve is used. This is yet another low RPM power enhancer, and Moto Tosinari has a superb reputation. There is a 6-speed transmission, and a compact clutch. The clutch actuator is integrated into the outer clutch cover, and transmission gears are forged. The 2018 Beta 125 RR uses kick-starting. However, there is an electric start option. The chromoly frame is based on the larger RRs, but redesigned for the smaller motor. At the bottom is a polyamide dash plate engineered to keep mud and rocks at bay. True to its European roots, the 2018 Beta 125 RR has FIM friendly tires. We would pull the stock Michelin Enduro competition rubber and save them for resale time. SAC suspension is used. It's close to the suspension used on the larger RRs, but has 125 specific settings. The open cartridge fork uses 48mm sliders. Nissan brakes are used. As the 125 can go nearly as fast the 250 and 300 RRs, it has the same brakes as its Beefire brothers. The fuel tank is a bit smaller than the big RRs. The 125 uses less fuel, so it has the same range as the 250 and 300 RRs. You're going to have to be patient if you want one. The 2018 Beta 125 RR won't be in US dealers until February 2018. We'll try to chase one down sooner for a test to find out if the bike is as enticing as it seems.